السلام علیکم و رحمۃ اللہ وبرکاتہ اف آور کلاتھنگ از اکارڈنگ ٹو اسلام دین اٹ بیکمز اے سورس آف اللہ بلیسنگز اینڈ مرسیز اینڈ وی کین گیٹ سو مینی فیورز فرام اللہ دیٹ وی آر پروٹیکٹڈ فرام دا skin diseases if our dress is according to islam because this dress is special signs of allah allah said in holy quran surah araf ayat number 26 zalika ayatillahi la allahum yazakkarun so this dress this clothing which is for men and women to wear according to islam is a sign of allah and sign of allah every time having so many blessings and mercies with it any person who is to change the signs of allah is always under punishment of allah and will find his or her place in the hell we can look at surah hajj ayat number 51 so allah said a'udhu billahi minash shaitanir rajeem بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم والذین سعو فی آیاتنا معاجزین اولائک اصحاب الجہیم and those who strive against our signs so to defeat us so those people will find their place in the hell fire so this is the allah's command for those people who are trying to change what allah said the clothing for us for men and women this is prescribed according to sharia we have to follow those one in order to hide our body if we are trying to make shortcut or cutting from the prescribed limit and to show the body parts before the people so we are trying to challenge allah to get the punishment in the form of hell according to holy quran surah hajj ayat number 51 so this way we must try to take those clothes which are according to the limits of sharia so we have to wear those clothes so that we can get allah's mercies and blessings in this world and the world year after and when we are just to put on clothes first of all we have to place our right arm in the shirt and left after and same like that when we are just to put on trouser or shalwar then we have to place our right leg first then left so if we are taking off clothes 
we have to do against it. First we have to take off left foot or left arm, then right. So if we do like this, this is the Sunna method, then the clothes they will also will become a source of special prayer from Allah for us. That is and other blessings for us. So one other very important thing when we are in the toilet, we should not talk because if we talk that time automatically the angels who are not with us that time because when we are inside the toilet that time angels are out they are not in the toilet because they don't want to see us naked so they are outside so when we try to talk then angels they come in to write down what we are seeing and they become angry and the angerness of angels make Allah angry. Same like that when we are in the bathroom taking bath we must be silent until unless we are in the bathroom. If we talk we say something then the angels will come in to write automatically they will become angry so when they are angry then Allah is angry so don't make the angels angry this is very important for us and uh, the other thing very important that uh, we look after our clothes our clothes must be according to the Sharia for men and for women women or girls they are not allowed to wear the dress or clothing that is worn by the men are boys similarly boys are the men they are not allowed to wear the clothing that is worn by the women or girls because according to hadith from trimsi book of hadith so those people will be under curse of allah so this is very important for us we have to look after otherwise Allah's angels are angry for us and Allah's curse falls on the person who is just to take the clothes of opposite sex same like that the clothes in which see through the body those are not allowed so very important for us because in one hadith that in Sahih Bukhari the women who are just to wear the clothes from which see through possible like those are very thin people can see through that the whole body of the woman and those clothes if the woman they are wearing so they will not be able to smell the paradise that comes for a long distance so it means paradise will be closed for those women when uh, 
ڈاٹر آف ابو بکر صدیق رضی اللہ تعالی عنہ اسما بنت ابو بکر رضی اللہ تعالی عنہ وین شی ہرڈ فرام ہولی پروفٹ صلی اللہ علیہ وسلم دیٹ یو آر ناٹ الاؤڈ ٹو ویئر دا کلوتھز وچ آر تھن سو دین شی اسٹارٹیڈ فرام دیٹ ٹائم تھک کلوتھز فرام ویئر دا باڈی از ناٹ ویزیبل very important for us so same like that we try to wear the clothes which are liked by prophets and which are liked by the sharia very important and uh, you know the kameez kameez mean short that is uh, also Uh, sunnah of uh, prophets like in holy quran we learn that uh, in surah yusuf when yusuf alay salam sent his shirt to his dad so he allah said in holy quran auzu billahi minash shaitanir rajim bismillahir rahmanir rahim izhabu bi kameesi هذا فالقوه على وجه ابي ياتي بصيرا سوره يوسف 93 ايه نمبر take my shirt and place it on the face of my dad his eyes will become enlightened so the mentioning of shirt is in this surah tells us that kameez is the good dress that has been worn by the prophets so we should take that one also we try to find the clothes which are worn by holy prophet sallallahu alaihi wa alihi wasallam liked by prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam and liked by the companion of prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam especially and we have to take those clothes that is very important for us because if we want to get special blessings of allah with full success in this world and the world hereafter then we have to follow the sunnah of holy prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam allah give us tawfeeq ameen